Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If you not yet subscribe, please subscribe and please support us. So here, how to underscore will be function in Java programs. What is the functionality of underscore in Java? In the different ways that program we are going to see now. So let's start our program for blank class lab. Now start main method public static void minus string ox. So here underscore is used for variables. It should be starting letter of variables, defining variables and printing. Now we'll check with int a will be equal to one two three underscore four two three. Then four six seven. Is that possible to print or not? Well check. We are going to give underscore in between number. Is that possible way to write or not? Underscore in numbers. Then print term plus e. So now we are going to check is the printing or not. Yes, underscore in numbers is going to printing. It's going to neglect that underscore in between numbers. That is one two three four two three and five six seven. Then another one. Then we're going to see what the another one is. Now we'll define something variable like int. B will be equal to in B will be equal to 1 2 3 then again int can we define underscore in variables yes underscore so underscore right under we can define like something int x will be equal to Let's write int underscore something the underscore the that will be equal to assign b for this. Then write system dot underscore in variables. variables underscore in variables that is underscore b a m u now we will check is that printing or not yes it's a printing we can start with the underscore in variables that is one two three here we are defined underscore d a m u so whatever we can start with the underscore is finished next one Next, we are going to check octagonal values can you assign or not with the use of underscore. Then find int c will be equal to c will be equal to 0 underscore 77. Then what is this? Can we print here underscore in octal numbers? Octal. So that one. We are going to check is that printing or not. Yes, it's a printing. In octal, it's going to define with zero underscore. Whatever it is, first we have to start the zero. After that, it's will be writing another one. Can we write zero one seventy seven? Then we'll check what is it number. Yes, it's a 127. 177 is 127. Then 101, we are going to check. This way, this range is only 0 to 7. We have to assign here. We should not exceed here 65. So here, 101 is 65. So for the capital A, here, you should not, we should give only range of 0 to 7 values in that. And 3 only. Then another one, hexadecimal, we are going to check int int d will be equal to hexadecimal starting with will be 0 x either 1 2 3 4 5 like that 1 let's start with 1 then capital a then capital b something up to 
what is the way to write is for this we have to give from 0 to 9 values and small a to f and capital A to F and what is the format is 0x some numbers and underscore underscore like that then here we are going to check the printing or not hexadecimal 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 then here we are going to print this D then it will going to print or not we will going to check yes it's a printing in underscore hexadecimal 427 yes it's a printing so for 1 underscore a underscore b is what 427 you can assign here 1 2 3 also then control bit underscore means this will go into negligible so it is a 1 underscore a underscore b1 is what 6833 whatever you can write but in between you can use the underscore but you are not supposed to use underscore after 0x we have to enter any letter or numbers from this then we have to continue then now we are going to check what is that is binary things binary means here int e will be equal to assign 0b either 1 or 0b either 1 or 0 underscore 0 underscore 1 underscore 0 then it will going to check underscore in binary underscore in binary what is that is e then we are going to check what is the printing with this or not Yes, it's a printing 10. Another binary format is there. We are going to check that also. Int f will be equal to 0b. There 1 defined. We are going to define 0 underscore. We have to start with 0 or 1 underscore 1 0 0 1 1 0. Then we are going to check. It will going to print or not binary then it is variable f yeah. then i am going to check what is the output yes it's printing 10 only 1010 it's considering 10100 is double so like this we have to print all the variables then we are going to check what are the values for double we are seeing only up to in for double we are going to check e g so for double what is the output values we are going to check so 1 underscore 3 underscore 9 underscore 9 underscore then we have to write 4 after that some number 5 underscore 3 then we are going to check what is this double values we have we should not enter points like that after the underscore like that so double double then what is this variable g then we are going to build this yes double is showing that 1394.52 so here we should not enter like what is the way what is the standard way to write is we should not enter like uh, um, something uh, like uh, let's try 1.2 sorry 1 underscore 2 3 underscore 4 underscore 0. 0.7 underscore 8 this is not at all way to write this is cancel this format this format not eligible this is not eligible to write this is not eligible for writing not like that here also we should not 0b underscore 0b underscore 1 underscore 0 after b you should not put underscore this is not eligible not right, not correct. 
correct way to write that not correct way to write that the next thought is one also how to write is so for this also 0 x underscore 1 underscore b a, a underscore d not correct way why because after 0 x we should not put underscore after 0 b we should not put underscore not correct way correct way so for this all we should not enter like this after the underscore or before the underscore is not the way to write then we are going to check what is this value then we are going to print some double now we will check here only we will put underscore in print of that or not then finally it will going to show some exception illegal underscore why because we should not put before this also we should not put after before this also we should not put. then we will check illegal underscore we should not enter after number and before number point should be there then it will be ok now it's printing all the values in the right way so here also when you put done check here can you print this so illegal underscore we should not enter underscore after b and for the x also we are going to check illegal exception illegal underscore we should not enter underscore between that these are the standard ways to write thanks for watching please subscribe and finally we are going to show output yes it's printing all the values nicely